So uh, that's good news. If you're treading water, uh, you're not slipping further behind. But of course, we want to see big improvements uh, with the drought monitor. But that, that can only happen if you have big storms. And we just haven't seen that lately. We do have a storm tonight. But again, I don't think it'll be very impactful for drought and for water. It's just something you need to plan around, especially for the commute tomorrow. Temperatures are cold this morning in the 40s. We've got the 20s and 40s up high. That's issue number one. It starts cold and it ends pretty cold. So there's not going to be a big change in the weather today. Uh, low level clouds at the ground level is called fog, and that's really a driving issue, certainly for the San Joaquin Valley and areas to the south. Ripon, Salida, uh, Escalon, Riverbank, Modesto, all these spots are going to be dealing with thick fog early this morning, and it's really thick and long lasting all the way to Bakersfield. And by the way, sometimes it's just the 99 side or just the 5 side. It's both sides all the way down, so heads up for that. Here's a look at our storm. It's it's there. I mean, it's going to happen, but it's just so weak and ragged and scattered. So, you know, don't expect too much from this as far as rain in the bucket. But again, any amount of rain on the roads gets it wet. You lose traction. It can be an issue. So watch for some of those issues to pop up tonight and early tomorrow morning. The dense fog advisory goes until 11 o'clock this morning. South, basically Turlock South all the way to uh, Bakersfield. Again, just for the morning hours. Everybody else will have patchy dense fog and then it'll be gray skies throughout the entire course of the day. Not windy, so bundle up in the morning and remember dress for the weather for the entire day. It's not going to warm up all that much. It's just one of those days waiting for the rain. When's it going to get here? It's not going to be till after sunset. So you've got all day where it's not really an issue. Then maybe later on tonight you're going to bed, put things away. You don't want to get wet because it shows up in the middle of the night. It does last through the early morning commute. Notice that there is some light snow down to about the pass level. It doesn't last very long and then it should last through the morning and then it breaks up later on in the day. The problem mostly with this, the timing of this is that we've got a big lunar eclipse that everybody's talking about. It is 97% full, uh, but it happens exactly as the system is moving through. So that is going to be a problem for us. It's going to be very difficult to see it, but you know what? Rain is rain. It's exactly what we need, but this is a one and done storm. This upcoming weekend, we are dry and all the way through Thanksgiving week, we should be dry as well. Brittany? That is good.